Hi folks, welcome again to another cooking video. Today I will be making a simple mushroom recipe. So what I have here is um, the white mushrooms that uh, you normally get at the grocery store. So I just um, slice them into thin um, thickness like that. And this is all going to go into the pan. You can also um, uh, use your favorite mushroom, but for this recipe, I, I like do doing this with the white mushrooms. So let's start Okay, cooking. so th my pan is already heating here. I'm not adding oil or butter at all. I'm just going to put in all the mushroom. And you probably notice that, you know, it's going to produce water and everything. And as soon as the water dries up, that's where we're going to add our other ingredients. One of the things I like about mushroom is, um, of course, we like it here at home. Um, I can prepare this in advance and cook it, then leave it in the fridge, you know, uh, for a couple of days or so. And I like to eat it with, um, sometimes you put it in your hamburger, um, like a topping, you know. And then I like it with uh, our spaghetti or you can make some, um, what do you call that, hamburger steak. Or sometimes, you know, when it's like pre-cooked and I already have it um, with me, then I can put it like in Subway by sandwiches. If I make some Subway sandwiches here at home. And uh, you can actually eat it basically with anything. And uh, this recipe that I'm showing with you is one of my favorites, especially if you're eating a piece of steak. Of course, you need mushroom, you know. Um, I go to this restaurant one time and you had to pay for five dollars for, you know, a little bowl of mushroom and um, yeah, it was good. It was okay, you know, but um, the taste is not really uh, what you were expecting for and then you pay about six dollars for it. So why not make it at home? This is easy to make and uh, if you're not eating it right away, just put it in the fridge and you can use it for some other recipes. So right now, as you can see, the uh, water is coming out of the mushroom, and we're just going to keep cooking this until the water dries up. So the water is almost evaporated. What I'm going to add right now, some butter, a little bit of your favorite cooking oil. That will mix that up. Then we start frying our mushroom. What I'm looking for is uh, like brown it a little bit. That nice uh, golden color. To that I'm going to add some pepper. A few drops of uh, soy sauce. Not much. and some oyster sauce just a little bit and that's where you're going to see the magic how this mushroom is really going to turn into a nice brown color and with the help of the oyster sauce and the soy sauce it gives you that golden brown color and it's more appetizing when you serve it with a piece of steak or you know you can eat it with whatever you choose put them in your subway sandwiches so just letting it cook a little bit more so there you go folks this mushroom is ready side dish for any meal that you want So there you go folks, thank you again for watching, for the full details of this um, simple recipe, I left you the link to my website below and you can also check my Facebook page once in a while, there are some folks there that post uh, some of the recipes that they tried, you know, you may do so as well. And if you like this video, uh, you may also share it, like it and even subscribe. I'll see you next time. Thank you.